All right, ladies, I decided on doing a swipe pour technique. Uh, if, this, if this all turns out nice and, and dandy and it works, um, I will obviously be giving credit to the author, to the author, to the artist uh, of which, whose video I watched, and uh, I'll be linking, obviously, their channel. But like I said, you know, a few seconds ago, you guys obviously probably know who she is. So it is what it is. Uh, just in case you guys don't know who she is, that way you guys can go check out her stuff because obviously she is next level and yeah it just it, it fascinates me how easy some of these people can make some of the stuff look while other people like <laughs> like me you know struggle but it's okay though because she is probably a professional artist where i am just a dude that likes to play with paint so ladies and gentlemen we are going to be using the turquoise blue we're going to be using some of the neon yellow and we're going to be using some of the neon orange and obviously i failed to show you guys the colors so here's the turquoise blue or turquoise i guess whatever you want to call it and then here is the neon yellow obviously and in this bottle i have uh the neon orange i don't know what color i said before but it's the neon orange and we're going to be doing the swipe with um I know you guys are going to kill me. We're going to be doing it with black paint. So, unless you guys have any objections, I suggest you yell really, really loud into the future. Or into the past. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to be able to hear you. So, I'm just going to go ahead and go with this color. So, with all that being said, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to start doing my my pour. And, yeah, we're going to go from there. But first, ooh la la, yeah, check that out. I'm going to wear some gloves. Why? Because it's true what they say about that black paint. If it gets under your nails, it's there for a minute. But I need to grab new gloves because those gloves have paint all over them. Ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Okay, a few more seconds. Now I need to put my gloves on. It's all right though. Safety first, right, ladies and gentlemen? We don't know where this paint has been. Okay, well, it's it's, it's been at the store and it's been here. Other than that, it's it's safe. All right, so we're gonna start with the turquoise blue. I am thinking about doing it this way, but then at the same time, since this is the short end, I was thinking maybe more or less doing it the long way. I'm thinking I wanna do it the long way just because I'll have more surface area. No, that doesn't make sense. The surface area won't change at all. The, 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 the layers of colors will be longer, I guess, versus if I just do it like this. Does that make sense? I don't know. Now I have no idea what I'm saying, so. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I've decided we're going to go the long way, but I'm going to lock my focus in because it's kind of annoying. Every time I look at the screen, woo, woo, woo. all right, here we go. Yeah. So here we got the turquoise. Now, I'm not sure if I want to start. Yeah, I'm going to start with it on, on an edge. But i got to be very careful because sometimes I have the tendency to kind of overdo it. or not go as far as I'd like. There we go. Slow it down, man, slow it down. I get a little too excited, ladies and gentlemen. See what I mean, see what I mean? That's probably already enough paint for the entire thing and I'm not even, not even done. Yes, I know, I need, I need to get more bottles, these squeeze bottles, there's so much more control. So much more control. So I'm going to, since I obviously didn't pour far enough this way, I'm just going to tilt a little bit just to kind of get the paint to spread a little bit more. Come on down, little paints. Spread down this way. Spread down this way. Little by little. Just march it down. March it down. All right. Take it back. Take it back. Take it back, paint. Take it back. <laughs> yes, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a long day, but it was a nice day today. It was in the low 80s and it rained a little and then the sun came out and then it got really humid for a little while. But then it got nice and cool after that. But anyways, enough about this weather stuff. Alright, so I'm going to take the black. I'm going to start the layer here and then I'm going to wipe it, wipe it, swipe it downward going that way. Now, I watered down this paint just in the hopes that I will not have to struggle as much but I'm hoping it doesn't blend into the colors as much obviously I have so much yellow here I, I maybe I should I'm gonna add a little bit more of this turquoise just to kind of just to kind of even out some of this yellow this is insane 
All right, now there's a ton of paint. But it's all right though, because that's how we roll. I like to use a ton of paint. Actually, no, I don't. I do it always on accident, but it's okay. All right, so now we're gonna add our black here. And actually, I'm gonna cover some of this because I need room to swipe downward. All right, so we're gonna hope we're gonna hope that that's enough. We're going to grab our trusty paint scraper thingy, spatula, whatever you want to call it. So now I probably should have done this the other way. In fact, let me just turn this whole thing around. Make it easier on myself. Make it easier on myself, ladies and oh shit, stuff. See, I didn't swear. I almost swore. I didn't swear. Maybe I did just a little under my voice. Now, now that looks like I'm gonna need a lot more black. This can go up to like right there. I just want to make sure I have enough black to get all the way to the bottom. All right, so obviously <laughs> from the last painting, I did not clean this off, so but it's dry. All right, so we are going to. I'm going to start in the middle, seeing that it's the whitest spot right there. Just bring that all the way down. Kind of overlap it. And then get the other side. I'm gonna try one more time down the center. Just kind of catch that last little bit. All right, so now for the secret concoction that she made. I tried to replicate it. I'm hoping it's going to work, but if it doesn't, then oh well. Keep this out of the camera's view so you guys don't see it. And then just kind of just drizzle it on there and see, and hope we get some sales. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know. Do you see any sales forming? Hey, you see my hands. Oh, that's cheating. All right, so now that you know the secret, I'm using dish soap. And obviously, it was from Olga Sobi and the Smart Arts uh, Materials channel, I guess that's the name of her channel, Smart Art Material, Smart Art Channel. And either way, I'll link it down in the description. But uh, yeah, I saw that video and I was just like, wow. I don't have a little spray bottle, so that's why I'm using this little brush. But I'm hoping, I'm hoping the effects are Somewhat similar. Somewhat. Although since I tend to use a lot of paint, it might not be. But it's okay though. Why? Because I'm about to grab a straw and see if we can't blow some of this around. But I need a hat because my hair is everywhere. Alright. Hopefully I didn't get a lot of paint on my hat. But Alright, so... Obviously, that's a little bit dark on that side, but it's all right though. It's all right. I'm gonna just blow some of this stuff around. Again, we're just playing with paint, ladies and gentlemen. I don't really expect this to look pretty or anything. It's just something new I wanna try. You know what? I'm gonna torch it first. I seen her torch it. Wait, torchy. Hello, where'd you go? Wow, we got a mystery on our hands, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know, oh, there it is. All right, just popped a few air bubbles. I kind of want to tilt it now. I'm going to tilt it. I'm going to tilt it around. Maybe get some of the this black end off a little and get some of this stuff to kind of squeeze down, squeeze down, scooch down. Whatever. You know what I mean. And if you don't know what I mean, then take a look. See? Just kind of pushing all that black paint off and kind of letting the, the cells migrate downward. Hey, that's looking kind of dope. But we don't got any paint on this edge over here. Whoa, what's going on here? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm slipping. Well, I shouldn't say that. I don't want this thing to like slip out of my hands. 
Oh, I'm going to take the stuff out of this thing. Look at those cells. They're getting bigger. Actually, I'm going to try to get these cells to go all the way down. No, Mr. Woochies, you've been a bad puppy. He was barking during my other video. Like, non-stop. Like, the UPS guy was here or something. He was all, row, 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 row. And I was like, oh my god, dude, just shut up. <laughs> but yeah, he's, he's my little eight, eight pound. Eight ounce. Well, he's not even eight ounces. What the hell? He's four pounds. He's a four pound little killing machine. And I'm definitely digging this, ladies and gentlemen. This is turning out pretty cool. At least I think so. It's rare that I think something looks cool. But I'm thinking this looks kind of cool. And once I put it back in the camera, I'm going to ask you guys to let me know what you guys think in the comment section. If you think this is a keep, or if you think they should just scrape this. And this I can easily scrape because it's the Corian. It'll stick on there, but just give it a little bit of a little bit of treatment with a paper towel and some water. And this paint literally peels off like butter. That doesn't make sense. Butter doesn't peel off like paper. Paper? Who said paper? I don't know. Ladies and gentlemen, first of all, I got a lot of paint in my hands. Second of all, let me know what you guys think. Check that out. Oh, oh, yeah. See? Ta-da. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to bring you down for a close-up after I get these gloves out of the way because it looks all funky. And, yeah, I'll see you in a second. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we got a little quick close-up. I turned off the overhead light because it's always a pain in my butt. And I'm standing in front of the bigger light. As you can see, if I get out of the way, I didn't really do anything. No, it does. A little. Um, so hopefully you guys can see the colors a little bit more uh, vibrantly. Is that even a word? I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Keep it. Don't keep it. Scrape it. Toss it. Give it to somebody who wants it. Anybody want it? I'll give it to somebody. No? Fine. I guess I'll keep it myself. Yeah. Get a little close-up. No, see? Ah, no close-ups. No close-ups. Because it looks all fuzzy. Nope. All right, whatever. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And yeah, if you like it, give it a like. And if you don't like it, then yeah, give it a like anyways. I'm just kidding. Give it a dislike. Yeah. But uh, yeah, if you're new here, you like what you see, smash that smash. I don't know why I say that. Please consider subscribing. There we go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys for watching. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.